Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to the Frungy Crush League. When we last left off, we had two people wounded, but we won two games in a row. Sadly, I discovered that I have Egomania, and so does Kermit. And so I read the instruction manual and found out that Egomaniacs refuse to play in the game altogether. They will never show up unless they are placed first in the roster, which means that the arena is not big enough for both me and Kermit at the same time. This arena is not big enough for the two of us. I am clearly the better player. I am better than you, Tegan. I am. I think I'm better than you, Kermit. You should go and sit on the bench, not me. You're not worth the stuffing that you're stuffed with. Well, I don't think you're half as good as a person with a hooked nose who has an affinity for chickens. You're not as funny as a bear who likes to tell bad jokes. You're terrible. Your speech is worse than Beaker. Oh, well, hey, that's... <laughs> All right, so basically, I will be the bigger person and sit out of the games and allow Kermit. Kermit, you're going to get yourself killed out there and whoops. Apparently, I accidentally left a suit of repulsor armor on this old XJS robot. Well, that's a shame. I could have had better equipment than I currently do, but I've won the first two games, so maybe I don't need that extra bit of cash. Still, it's kind of embarrassing, but I'm not sure. Kermit's... Kermit, I'm not sure how much, how long you're going to last, but eventually Kermit is going to get injured, and when he does, then I will take his place. Hopefully. He does have a booster belt, and he is a bit more fragile. So, yeah, that'll work. It is a shame that both I and Kermit cannot be on the same field, but I think it will still be okay, as long as no one else gets egomania. But it's... Kind of a shame. Alright, anyways, I guess that sorts out the rosters for now. I've got two XJS robots on my team, which is a bit of a concern, but that's alright. We still have replacements to back us up. Just one of them. It cannot. I, I, I just cannot be on the field. I wish to play against the hybrids and the rotting death. The hybrids were one of the people. The hybrids were winning, and the Rotting Death is a classic champion from previous seasons. So we've got some pretty stiff competitions. I don't remember the hybrids. Were the hybrids in this? I don't. I don't remember the hybrids from any of the previous seasons. Did, were, were they in there? I, I. I never remember them in any league games. I seem to be forgetting. All right, Kermit is on the field, which is good, because he's got the ego. But he did not get the ball, and he did not get injured either. That's a shame. I was hoping to get on the field in the future. I'm almost hoping that uh, uh, Kermit get injured, gets injured now so I can take the field in future games. That's a weird feeling to have, but I guess it's all right. <laughs> Ooh, boy, I do have an ego main. I do have an ego problem if I do want my character out that so badly that I'll... Ooh, okay. Well, that's a shame. The... Robbins has been kicked out due to the booster belts. But we got Kermit. Kermit's way better. Ah, very nice, Dead Soul. You are the goalie. You sit next to the goal and make sure no one gets in there. Kermit, good luck stripping the ball from the rotting death's ant person. I hope you can do it. But if you can't, I totally understand. All right then. The uh, the hybrids have an interesting setup. They are definitely they're the greens. They are the greens. They're Kermians and Gronks. Let's go greens. Indeed. I can see why their setup is rather effective. They've got the speed and they've got the punch for late game. They've got the early game movement and the late game power to back things up. Now, I reviewed the game mechanics, and I, I it sounded familiar. I knew it before, but I kind of forgot how it worked. The teleporters. There are six teleporters, and if you get teleported to the same teleporter that you were on, in that one out of six, then you get blob. So, going into the portal, there's a one out of six chance that you're going to get blob, which is actually pretty freaking high. That's a lot higher than I like, so I generally don't like using the teleporters. Yeah, just go ahead and jump, Kermit. Get over next to the ball carrier and and challenge the ball carrier. Yes, I 
I think you should. All right. Uh, go ahead and let him strike you, because you've got... Oh, you only have reinforced pads. I thought you had surge pads. I'm sorry. Well, Kermit, just get in his way and react to him. You are better at reacting thanks to your boxing lessons. Although I don't completely condone Kermian violence. Uh, you do have karma. And uh, also, I would like to get on the field, honestly. <laughs> we do have a backup for you if you get injured, so there's... There is more reasons. I, I am willing to take more risks than ever with Kermit's because of uh, recent developments. The Rotting Death is powering up steadily. The Rotting Death is becoming a concern with the number of ants that are on the field now. Cutter is on the field. I am going to have Cutter... Well, last time he did this, he got blobbed. Okay. Cutter, congratulations. You successfully teleported. <laughs> I, uh, I, I instantly regretted what I just did by having you teleport, but the, uh, the ball carrier is getting away, so. I also learned how supporting works. I, like, for, for example, anyone who's next to you will support a melee against you. Or anyone who's surrounding you, so. You want to be surrounded by as few enemies as you can when you, uh, melee someone. Which means that this would be a bad place to be because two people would be melee, uh, supporting the melee of me. But I'm going to jump here. And yes, I did not get attacked. And while I'm standing here, he had no support. But he would have support if I attacked him. Which is an issue still. Alright, well, Kermit got knocked down, but he tried. He tried his best. We're just going to have to rely on other people to knock down our opponent, hopefully. Wow, nice one! Now you see, right there, he had a friend helping him. So he had plus 10 to his checking skill. Nice! Take that, an op opposing Gronk. It's a bit scary fighting a- Damn it! You've gotta be kidding me! Oh, good, good. I was worried that that guy was going to get blobbed for sure. He got teleported again. That lowers- af After two teleports, that lowers his chances of being blobbed to basically one out of three. Or No, I'm not doing my math right, but it lowers his chance of being blobbed considerably going through two teleports instead of one. That's for sure. A third time? You've got to be kidding me! And- Oh my god! I cannot believe it! I teleport, and then one out of six chance that somebody teleports in on the teleporter I'm in, and another one out of six chance to te teleport on the teleporter I'm in, and then one of the enemies had a booster belt. Damn it, Cutter. You have got bad, bad luck. That's all I gotta say. Cutter is... Cutter... I'm surprised Cutter does not have blobophobia. I'm... From now on, I'm just... I'm, I'm tired. I'm tired of being blobbed. I'm tired of being blobbed in general. Okay, so... We're gonna use Thripax here. And Thripax, we're going to use the assisting mechanic now. So... Uh, Thripax, you have guard. You can uh, give extra assisting to Dead Soul here. So Dead Soul is going to get plus 10 checking, or it's 150% bonus, so plus 15 to his check value when doing this check. So his checking value is going to be up to 85 when hitting the Kermian. That's going to be pretty brutal for him. And it was a successful check, but the Kermian did knock my, my guy down. <laughs> that was bad luck for me, actually. Oh well. I enjoy violence. And the hybrids are doing well in the league, so I don't feel completely bad doing violence against the the hybrids. But Rotting Death is a bigger concern, so I probably should be focusing on the Rotting Death a bit more. Fortunately, that's... The hybrids are, are doing a good job of doing violence to the Rotting Death. Oh, uh, Cutter. I feel so bad about Cutter. He's always getting blobbed. He has terrible luck with the blobbing. I... Ugh. I should not... I should have not had him mess... I felt... I, I knew! I knew he was gonna get blobbed the second he stepped in the teleporter. I didn't think it would happen after three times, but... That were... Un, not of his own will. And then the belt, but still. I kind of... Ex somehow I, I knew that was... Somehow I knew that was going to happen. Kermit has been injured by his booster belt. Considering the number of games he's been in, that, that seems reasonable. Nithu? No. No, no, no teleporters. I don't care if you hurt yourself by jumping. No teleporters ever for you. 
or for our team ever again. No teleporters. Do not like them. Okay, Thripax, I'm gonna have you mess with the Gronk because you've got the pads. All right, and Dead Soul, we're gonna mess with the Gronk because we're gonna get the support on you. All right, well, even with the supports, it's not enough. All right, so why don't you check me? I've got extra defensive value. Extra de checking defensive value when I'm close to my friends. So that's the general idea. You keep your friends together and they support each other when you get checked. So those two guys are supporting each other. Midas is just trying to get into the combat here. He's got surge pads and that's it. All right. Well, I shouldn't really be parading my Ant-Man in front of a Gronk. <laughs> Actually, yeah, that parading my Ant-Man in front of a Gronk was just kind of asking for it, wasn't it? Even though he, even though he has surge pads. Ooh, brutal. Well, we some there's a reasonable amount of damage done to the hybrids today, which is good. That's what we want. We want damage done to the enemy teams and not not me in particular. That's going to lead to our victory in the league in the long run. Heavy armor on a robot. Interesting decision. These guys have 89 or 98 handling now. Wow. The hybrids are getting messed up. But that means I only have a 2% chance of dropping the ball. Or not picking up the ball. Pretty freaking high. Alright, come on over, my opponents. You know you want to. Uh... You're gonna need to use a teleport to get into the game, my friend. And robots are awesome at teleporting because they have the gyro stabilizer. Good enough, I suppose. There's no sense teleporting more than you need to. It's kind of awkward that robots get blobbed, but they do. I guess metallic parts can get... Metal can get blobbed just as easily as flesh. And it's just what the teleporters like to do. <laughs> Alright, so... I really want to melee the Kermian, but I know the ants are coming this way. So if I was him, I'd jump and then try to go for the goal there. I'm just going to remain standing where I am, because if I move towards this Kermian, he might check me. And I'll still, if they jump, he'll let, he has, you guys have 70 AP. Jumping takes 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. You have enough to get to the goal if you successfully jump. Is that what you're telling me here? 30, 40, 50, 60... 70. Yeah. 30. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I, uh... Hmm. How am I going to prevent this? Just gonna hope that I have the reactions to check him as he goes by? He probably won't even go by Dead Soul, will he? Oh, this is... Oh, oh. Oh, these ant people and their extra movements is an uh, issue. It does, it does cost, it costs 30 to jump. 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. That is, that is, that is an issue with my uh, goalie plan. Well, he's going to have to pass by one of us to get to the goal. Or if he jumps, jump there, and then there, and jump there. You have to step over. You would have to step over to jump here. You can jump here and here, but if you jump here. Um, And you'll still make it if you jump here. I was thinking of standing on these two positions. Or maybe if I stand here and here, you'd have to jump here. Oh, I'm overthinking this. Just to stay where you are and hope that you can stop them. And Midas is going to try to catch up. 
Nice! You electrocuted a frog just by walking by. Attack these ants even though they're supporting each other. That did not work. I'm just gonna hold position and hopefully I can catch the ant as he passes me by. Please don't. No, no robots. Do not. Come on, Dronk. You can. No, you can't. So you don't have the time. Kermian did not either. Oh, they decided to hand. They they tried to hand off the ball and fumbled it. That is surprising. A fumble on a handoff there. And oh, we messed up the ants. Ha ha. I am surprised. I thought he would just jump past me and sneak by and win, but they're being a bit more cautious. Oh, that that's what I was expecting. That's a bit more what I was expecting. Okay, okay, so now we got the robot with the repulsor. I'm gonna see what you can do. Mutation? Not yet. We're getting close to the end of the game, so I might as well try it. All right, scrambler belt. You take you mutated my robots. Well, that's probably the only thing keeping him alive. We're probably lucky you did that. I guess it's maybe I don't really know. So, Midas here, if he fights with this frog, will win because he'll shock him, but that frog had a support bonus from the nearby Gronk. Okay, so Thripex. I want you to move up here and give Dead Soul the support bonus. In fact, step forward one more space. Oh, dang it. Now you, I would lost the support bonus. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Nice! Okay, that works! That works! All the enemy potential ball carriers are down. Now, Dead Soul, try to pick up the ball yourself. Nice, Dead Soul! You've got the ball. You look confused. But, go with it. Uh, if, at the very least, they're going to have to attack you to get the ball from you. And that's bad news for the enemy. Okay, well. A. Kermian managed to wound you. Luckily, the, the medical belt saved you again. Dead Soul has gotten a lot of value. Nice! Nice! One of the rotting deaths... Nine axes have been killed. That is a major loss for them, as they do not have enough nine axes to replace them. That having one less ant for the rest of the season means that they'll just be less effective for the rest of the season. I mean, they might win this game, but ooh, they're gonna be crippled from now on. And I'm gonna get a chance to knock him down. Okay, uh, Dead Soul, step here so he'll try to attack you. Nope. Okay, try to melee him. Damn it! Thripex! Uh, think carefully before we move. I... want some support on this next attack. Alright, XJS, you get to move up first. I was supporting you, which probably helped you not get killed by that ant. Okay, now you support me on this ant while I punch him. And it was not enough support. Okay, run away, XJS robots. Or should, yeah, run away, XJS robots. <laughs> I don't care if it means me losing. Run away so you can live. And I want to do more damage to the rotten death, so. That was not more damage to the rotten death. Okay, Thripex, you're our only hope. He did not get shocked by attacking you. Attack him, I guess. Nice! And he's got the ball. I cannot believe that. That was really lucky. All right, the match is continuing. Let the carnage continue. This is a surprisingly long match. I thought it was going to end any moment. I thought it was going to end a few rounds ago, honestly. Wow, Thripex, you did some good fighting there. The ball is cornered. If the ball is completely cut off and is unable to move, it will teleport. But it, it did not quite teleport. It barely had enough space to maneuver. All right, and Dark Soul and Thripax are back on the field, are back up. Ha, you have been shot. And the ball was able to move. Oh, it did teleport. It wanted to move two spaces. Wow, it, it teleported to the other side of the field. That means that there's going to be a lot more carnage. Oh boy. Oh, that's like a dream come true to me. 
That's exactly what I wanted out of this. What more could you ask for? Thrifax? I was hoping that you could wound someone, but not quite. Alright, XJS units, support your friends. You and Naithu. Yeah, you, you you support Naithu. Just help his checking ability. Guard him. Guard him like the guard robot you are. No, you've got intuition. Like the intu intuitive robot you are. Alright, doesn't sound as uh, cool, but... They're gonna get the ball. That's fine. I will let them get the ball. What? Okay. We've been seeing a couple of those Gronks get injured. It's surprising. They have regenerated their injuries, but still, it's surprising. I, I've, I've thoroughly enjoyed this round. My two biggest competitors have taken a fair amount of damage. Damn, I was hoping that guy would get injured, but not quite. Alrighty. Dead soul. Let's see. I am going to... You've got full movement. Your back step here. Dead soul move up. And get ready to melee that ant. Damn, Dead Soul. You did not successfully melee the ant. I am surprising considering the amount of assistance and checking the power you had there. It is a disappointment, but that is fine. It is a disappointment I will have to live with. XJS unit, support your friendly Kurgan. Naithu with the space rot. Make sure not to get punched until we get close enough. That is. You've got surge pads, and you'll never dodge anything. <laughs> All right. Yep, you did not know how to dodge. I was hoping with your checking value you'd be able to withstand that attack. Aha, but the robot did. Come on, Midas. Give him the Midas touch. All right, please do not murder my robots. I'm surprised that somebody still has people to get out on the field, but apparently, yeah, that was our last member. That was our last member, okay. Or no, he was, I guess he was teleporting back in after being, uh, I guess I was, was that teleporting back in after being, uh, regenerated, maybe? Injured. Crippled. Wow. Yeah, a lot of damage is being done to these two teams, whereas I have not received much in the way of damage, so. Once again, I am happy with how things are turning out so far. Although that violence was annoying. <laughs> Being knocked over like that. I don't I don't appreciate violence that I don't win as much. Still. We are going to deal as much damage as we can to the rotting death. Repex, support me! Dead soul, rip them apart. Nice! Ish. That works, I guess. Okay, that's a bit more painful. Hot dogs. Hot dogs indeed. Just continue to be the gatekeepers of these this area, my friends. Uh, just like that. So you guys just back up your friend there. That frog just cannot get the ball. I probably should have sent some sort of representative to go get that ball, but I'm more interested in violence at this point. I'll get the ball uh, when it. I'll let the ball come to me. I mean, getting the getting the rushing points is nice because it helps you upgrade your members. Rushing being holding the ball and moving. That, that's just clearly not why I'm here. That is not, not the intent. Dead Soul, don't let them get so, so much support on you. Aha! Would you like to fight Dead Soul? No? Okay, I'll just... I'll just wait till my friend wakes up here. And... Let's gang up on a Kermian! First the robot moves up. 
Then Naithu moves up. And now Midas moves up. Midas will give him the touch. Nice. It would have been a bit of a concern if he went crazy there, because he would have really murdered my friends. Naithu, you've got the surge pads. Thank you for helping our friend here. We have one more space. Aha! Surging for you. And you do have magnetic gauntlets, Mr. Robot, so remember, you can pick up the ball pretty darn well. I guess, yeah, our little squad here is going to go for the ball. Why not? Oh, except for... I wanted you guys to support each other. Now the formation has broken apart. Oh well. Nice. Take that, Mr. Kirbyan. Although I want to do more damage to ro the Rotting Death. But I'll take whatever I can get. Considering both of these teams are my greatest competitors. Looks like we have ran out of friends over here. Just gonna get up to the edge and uh, wait, I guess. Well, actually, let's turn around and do some fighting. I changed my mind. We got some ants behind us that are just asking for violence. Alright, it's good of you to get out of the way, my froggy friend. Things are about to get ugly. The XJS unit has no business fighting. Well, maybe against a frog, if you've got some checking support. Okay, well, when a frog and a robot fight, there are no winners. Seems about right. I'm surprised at the total lack of vortex armor or repulsors in this uh, game so far. The rotting death are very scary when they get all their members out. Very formidable. Even though one is out and one is dead. Alright, let's try to do some damage to the rotting death, shall we? Come on, Mr. Robots. And then Midas moves up. Aha! You have made a mistake. You both made a mistake. But you... And you are both lucky to be alive, honestly. I too. Go ahead and see if they'll check you. <laughs> wow. We just shocked the entire enemy... We shocked all the ants. Fried ants. And then a Kermian took down my... My Kurgan. But I got ants revenge on him. So, uh, that's okay, I guess. And these guys don't want to move. I mean, I guess Dead Soul could jump, but he risks getting injured. And I do need a good goalie. I guess Thripax could go out there, but I don't want to be next to that, that Gronk. I don't want to land next to that Gronk, so... Yeah, let's just hold position for now. Gronk scare me. <clears throat> a Gronk would scare me even if I had him surrounded. Basically speaking. I feel like the rotting death is getting a significant amount of control. They are definitely winning. But we're ganging up on them. It's like us versus them, basically. 
All right, Midas, give him the touch. Although they're they're working together, they have a defensive setup right there. Let's not melee them. Let's see if we can get them to attack Naitu here. And they did, and they did not get shot. That was the plan, and it did not work. It failed. The plan is a failure. Okay, and my XJS unit is now isolated. My XJS unit is going to uh, back up slightly, I guess. I want to move Dead Soul out there, but I'm worried that Dead Soul is going to uh, get passed by and they're going to get to the goal. Oh, but Dead Soul wants to get in the violence. Dead Soul must go to violence. At least Dead Soul did not get injured by jumping. Hopefully he'll be able to get up in time to make a difference in this melee here. And Thripax will hold this corner. Yeah, robots, you are no longer isolated. Robots, provide assistance for the ants. We're making a wall here. Come on, you guys. Stop those ants. Okay. You injured yourself bumping into an ant. That sounds as pathetic as it is. Please don't do acts of violence against my robots. Please don't do acts against of violence against my robots. Come on. Come on, Midas. Dang it. Come on, Midas. You can do it, Midas. Dang it. Oh, that was the ball carrier. That was the most important one. Alright, Midas, that guy's got support now, so he's going to be difficult to take out. But you've got surge pads, maybe you can get him to attack you. No, you cannot. Wall attack him? Dang it. Oh, I wasn't expecting too incredibly much considering. Alright, boys. Knowing what I know now about guarding, let's make a wall. A wall... Not a solid wall. Let's let's make them move through our wall by making a delta formation with Dead Soul at the tip so that he gets more support. These two guys will support Dead Soul. That's the idea. We provide him a checking bonus by being within his area when he gets checked. Of course, if we were up further if we were up further then we would also give him a bonus when he checks someone, but he might not get as much action. It's a tough choice. Actually, do step back one so that when you check someone, we'll both give you support, potentially. Although, then we could actually be hits. Oh, I'm not sure. Maybe the Delta formation was a better formation. Oh, well, too late now. I made my choice. Here we go. Come on, you guys. Let's stop that rotting death. Yeah, I, th I think the rotting death are going to win this one. Wow. But I stand by the amount of damage I've dealt to them. I'm glad... Nice. Nice. That's more like it. If we can keep working them down, we're going to change this. Oh. Yeah, you, do, you don't want to fight Dead Soul. You do not want to fight Dead Soul. Yeah, those are the guys you want to fight. You were lucky... Oh, no! Oh, crippled robots. At least I'll be paying less for that robot later, but... Oh, no. Okay. Yeah, you do not want to run by Dead Soul. Nope. You, uh... Dead Soul, just keep the fight going. Kill them. Okay, uh... Wait, is Dead Soul my last guy? No, no, I got people back here. I've got Naithu, and I've got Midas. Naithu, try to catch up. Yes! Yes! Ha ha ha! The ball is now free for me to pick up. But I did not do that. Still, it's free. The ball is free. It will not be scored against me. All right, well, Dead Soul can't do anything because he doesn't feel like stepping on a shock pad or walking back and forth. Cork did not pick up the ball because he is ham-fisted. The ants keep getting weaker as we slowly reduce their number, but... It is a slow process. Almost. Come on. Ooh, he 
didn't push me onto a shock pad. I'm lucky I didn't... Uh, I got knocked down. Dead soul, get off that shock pad. First and foremost. Alright. Uh, third packs, go ahead and step one forward so that dead soul can give you the support you need. Dead soul, hold that position. Uh, Nithu, take one step over. Midas, we've got you surrounded, ball carrier. Wow, I can't believe he dodged those two. That was some great evasion on his part. Considering we're getting a large checking bonus against him, who should go next? I believe Nithu should be the one. Ah, uh, Nithu has failed me. Thrupex. Sadly, you're not as good at checking now because of the reductions. Well, we're just going to keep him surrounded. What? What did that say? Draw game? Was that a draw? I... It, that's weird. The game ended. I guess we ran out of rounds. Players mutated. One. Yes. I got two of my people blobbed. Well, the MVP was Thuax. But yeah, no one scored. Both the enemy teams lost 25 points. No one scored. Let me go back. That was a tie. Yes, that was considered a tie because the game just went on too long. Fair enough. XJS is messed up, but Zoidberg is available again. Welcome back, Zoidberg. I said, welcome back, Zoidberg. Zoidberg, here are your pads and gloves. I am wearing some reinforced armor. That robot is wearing the repulsor pads. Actually, Zoidberg, you're tough enough. Take these repulsor pads. Why not? You're sly. And I think I want Zoidberg a little bit higher in the rosters. Yeah, you're ahead of Thrupex. And Thrupex is ahead of Nithu. Okay, so we got... Oh, and Cutter can go before Midas, I guess. So we got Kermit, Robbins, Dead Soul, Cutter, Midas, Zoidberg, da -da 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 -da. me on letter C because I can't be in the same game as Kermit. Okay, let's do another round. I'm going to be with the Paladins and the Volcanoes. Rough. Yes, simulate all computer games. Okay, play. The Paladins, all nine axes, volcanoes, all slith. Rough opponents. And the Paladins get the ball on the first turn. I am not pleased with this development. This turn of events. Kermit, just be prepared to intercept the ball if he ever drops it. Be waiting to scoop it up. He might try to jump over those electrical pads and he might fall down. Like that. Only this time it'll be... Uh... Nope, he made the jump. And he snuck right by you. What are you doing? What are you doing there, Kermit? Robbins, just go for it. There's no time. All right, then. Kermit, I want you to commit acts of violence. I believe in you. I believe in you. I no longer believe in you. This is going poorly. The Paladins are getting a wonder what runaway one away. Runaway victory at this moment. I think the Paladins are gonna win this one really easily at this point. Unless I get it unless I teleport one of my guys in, in the right position. Nope. And I don't like using teleporters. Don't like it. All right then, fine, be a jerk. You know that you're not being productive here because the enemies are getting away with the ball. Please don't conflict with me, thank you. My word. Just sometimes everything goes wrong in a match.
Oh well, I've had good luck so far in most of my matches, so... I feel like I had a loss coming to me. Yeah, this is a brutal one. Cutter, you like getting blobbed! Nope. Aw, blah, a cutter. <laughs> I thought, I thought you wanted to get blobbed in every single game this season. Come on. What happened? What happened to your oath? Your blob oath. Well, looks like it's over. Unless that Sith, unless that Slith can save the game. Can you? Take that. Can you? Come on. Damn it. Well, unless he gets a reaction movement, but... I doubt it. I think this game is over. With the next movement of that guy. Well, that was, at least it was fast. At least it was fast. Victory to the Paladins. Well done, Paladins. Ooh. So how are the Paladins doing? They have won twice and lost twice. At least they aren't my competition. But it doesn't help my standing in the league to get a loss. Next game! Oh, I forgot to look at my, uh, my roster again. Oh well, too late. Red Jelly hosts the hybrids, who don't have as many people in before as before, and the Rat Pack, who are almost all robots. Oh boy, this is going to be delicious. This is going to be delicious violence. Ooh, and the one, the one Kurgan they had just got kicked off the field. Oh my god, this is going to be a field day. But Kermit has just got shot. Still, unless, unless somebody gets a crazy runaway victory like last game, I am just going to have a field day of violence. Aw, one of the robots got kicked off. I wanted to kick him out of existence in this universe. Uh, okay, so... One, two... Yeah, this, this one's closer. I just want to see if I can get that other one. Right, go for it, Robbins! And Robbins has the ball disturbingly close to uh, some... Uh, Bronks. And Kermit's going to go support him. The teleporters are in interesting locations in this field. It, rather than uh, rather than jumping over the electrical pads, you can choose to use a teleporter. Interesting, interesting configuration, I must admit. Robbins, I can understand if you're starting to feel hemmed in. Careful there, Kermit. Oh, Dead Soul has been kicked out. Oh, he wanted he wanted to get involved in the violence so badly. Oh, that's so much sadness for him, Robbins. I suggest you run away. <laughs> That's what I suggest you do for now. Make them chase you. You're fast. And also you can get a few extra points for uh, rushing. I would say. Not the worst strategy. Alright. Although as time passes, more opponents will be going, getting on the field, so... Maybe charging through them would have been a better idea, but... I want to outwit them, if possible. Alright, you're kicked out. Robbins got kicked out by the booster belt this turn of all turns. Oh man, at least you made some yardage before you did it. But 6% chance of being kicked out and it happened. Well, Kermit? Uh, Kermit got the recovery, okay. Well, that's fine then. That's, that's fine. I mean, it's a minor setback, but it's okay. Cutter, you actually get to enjoy violence. Okay, then. You're terrible. <laughs> you are terrible at violence. It's what Kurgans are all about, and you're no good at it. Shame on you. Okay, Kermit, I really hope you don't get knocked out by your booster belt. Haha, -ha, I have teleported someone else for a change using the uh, popping in thing. Okay, Midas and Dead Soul, we're going to escort Kermit the Frog. M the Ker Kermit the Kermian. Make sure he does not get smashed into Frog Kermian Mash. 
a lovely Kirby and Mash mashed up. Yeah, just stay. Stay with your friends, even though you've got 10 movement left. Stay encased in a ball of fur and love. <laughs> a ball of fur and teeth and love. <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm, I'm so used to saying a ball of fur and teeth and rage. But not in this case. They welcome you with open arms. Haha, -ha, you have been teleported by Zoidberg. It's nice that I'm actually teleporting other people for a change. I'm so used to being the victim of teleportation. Not the victor. Victor? The, the perpetrator of the teleporting. Kermit, do not go near that frog. He wants to commit acts of violence against you. Stay. Stay there. Zoidberg will move up. And yeah, you support him. Support Zoidberg for the checking bonus. Do you want to hit Zoidberg? No? Well, Zoidberg wants to hit you. Okay, fine then. Uh, Cutter. Do not use the teleporter. We know you wanna. But don't do it. In fact, rather than doing that, you should have walked around like Midas is going to do. Because jumping... Oh, Midas is terrible at jumping, but jumping is just not the thing that these guys like to do. Uh, don't know they're supporting each other. Nope, let's pass on that violence. Right, right. Zoidberg had the repulsor armor. I forgot that I gave Zoidberg my only suit of repulsor armor. Oh, Zoidberg is repulsive. Ooh, that's going to cost me. That is going to cost me, because I'm not going to get the protection bonus. And Kermit is going to get kicked over, isn't he? Probably. Oh no, oh good, good. Well still, Kermit got pushed back, which isn't cool, but... Kermit could have made it this turn if it wasn't for Zoidberg. Well, he still can do it. Kermit can still do it. We can still do it. Just get Kermit... Right there. And get Zoidberg directly behind it. Yeah. And then we'll have repulsive armor victory. Hooray. Hooray, hooray, kalu, kale. What a fabulous day. Cutter, would you like to cut a frog? Yes. Would you like to be blobbed? Why the hell not? Nope. Oh, actually, that could have been a sort of a bad thing. But <laughs> you almost blobbed a robot. Midas! Okay, fine. Get beat up, beaten up by robots. Now push Kermit to victory. Victory! All right. So that's our third victory this season. Very, very good. Well done, Kermit. I guess you deserve to have your ego. <laughs> oh, I... I guess... I guess you are better than me, Kermit. Very good. And Kermit is saving up for the quickening. I can't wait. It costs 60 points. He just needs two more points. And then Kermit will have the quickening. And he will be quicker than anything in this game. And that will be entertaining. All right. I guess... The Kermian is still wounded. So, let's do one more game. Because those, some of those games were fast. All right. The Paladins, curse them, and the Vipers. I do not like the Paladins, the Vipers, all robots. That's a bit concerning because they're probably modded to all get out. They're all probably modded to all hell. They probably have a lot. What I'm saying is they have a lot of illegal equipment. Although I'm doing pretty good on that front too. Just barely can't get to the ball bin on the very first turn. So close. Haha. -ha. Your illegal gear does not help you get into the match. That's a big problem with going with that strategy. Hey, no, no, stop. No violence, please. I don't want to do violence. Not a fan of the violence. Robbins is also on the field. 
This next stage makes it difficult to get away with the ball once you get it from the ball bin. Because no doubt there's going to be enemies nearby waiting to take the ball from you. Jump away, Kermit. Jump away and live. And get near the robot and your friend. You want that ball bin? No. Get this ball bin. And it is the correct ball bin, the very first one, because Kermit is freaking amazing. Okay, now we're gonna have to get by one of the paladins, which is annoying. If I can avoid this robot, which I did! Congratulations! Now, if I can only avoid the paladin, that's the main concern. Oh dear. Oh no. No, please. Nice! You can't reach, can you? Nope. I think we have a breakaway upper. Booster belt! Damn it! Why? Why when I'm carrying the ball of all times? The booster belt only injures the player if you are carrying the ball. <laughs> Is that how it works? I think that's how it works. Damn it, Robins. Use your hands! Dead Soul fights the robots. Nice! You bet you wish had sur you uh, you bet you wish you had surge protectors at this moment, don't you? Well, you don't. Well, I guess you did enough to get you stunned. You're lucky to be alive, robots. I'm sure that level of electri electricity was far beyond the manufacturer's uh <laughs> suggested levels. Interesting. He decided to give me a wide berth so I don't uh, combo against or react to him. As if you need to worry about a frog that much, a Kermian. Cutter! Get your friend's guard value. And what the hey? Let's do some violence to this robot. He doesn't deserve it. But who in life does deserve violence? Alright, and then we will prepare ourselves to block the ball carrier. No ball carriers coming through here. Robins, you only probably, you, you only have so long before the booster belt takes you out of the game. However, I want you to wait and wait for an opportunity. If he comes this direction, we're gonna smash him. If he tries to go the other direction, well, then we're gonna have to uh, uh, readjust our strategy. Although every turn we wait, more paladins are coming into the field. Maybe I should have just struck. I do not like these paladins. I wanted to cause them harm. I want to cause them serious harm. Yes, Midas. Come out on the field. Prepare to harm your opponents. Okay. Cut Tor. Robins. I can't help myself but kill Nice. I can't help myself but kill my opponents. They must die. I'm moving towards my enemies, but they are faster than me, so they could potentially get away. Well, I'm forming a sort of wall. Let's just see what they do. How are you going to react to this? It's difficult. It's difficult fighting the paladins because I the longer I wait, the worse the situation gets. But I don't want to be too aggressive because they might slip by me too. It's a hard decision. And I don't know what that ant is doing running around in the corner. But I guess that's okay. Aha! I have caused a teleportation chain reaction. Why is it that nobody gets blobbed besides me? Really, that was a really high chance of one of my enemies getting blobbed and it did not happen. I do not know why. Let's get that ball carrier! Get him! Alright. Cutter. Dead soul. Robins, back your friends up. Uh, yeah, you move forward first. Ooh, he not, not, knocked you now. Okay. Cutter. Nice, Cutter. Nice. Well done, Cutter. You have liberated the ball from the opponent. But you did not pick it up. 
However, Dead Soul might. Dead Soul, you actually have a really good reputation when it comes to picking up the ball, but you did not succeed. You've you've had a really good uh, you've had a really good record when it comes to picking up the ball, but not today. Uh, but the odds are not with him, of course. His stats his, his stats aren't good. He's just he had he's had really good luck. So I mean, it makes sense that he did not have good luck this time. Okay, the Paladins nearly have all their members out. They are getting really scary. They have almost full handling now, so of course... that He did not pick up the ball. Okay, I thought I was, I was sure he was going to pick up the ball. Well, that was really unlucky for him. So these all 9x teams are brutal. Once they get all their members out and they start assisting each other, it's hard to stop them. It is really hard to stop them. They just get immensely good at checking and supporting each other and everything. Alright, I want to take out their members, but I want to take out the ball carrier more. Let's see. Cutter, you have electro armor. Tell you what, Robins, move up one space. Okay, Cutter, move up. You've got the support of your friends here. Alright, then Dead Soul, move up. Alright, aha, you've been shocked, which means you cannot support your friends anymore. Cutter, threaten the ball carry. Robins, you don't have shock beds, do you? Nope, just reinforced. Continue to threaten the ball carrier. Try to get him to attack you. Dead soul, move up into the support of your friends. Aha, the ball carrier struck and failed. So now, I'm going to let Robbins pick up the ball. I think you can do it, Robbins. I thought you could do it, but apparently you can't. Cutter also cannot do it. I am bad at having bad luck when it comes to ball carrying. Oh, but we have one, one designated ball carrier. He can do it, Zoidberg. But he cannot withstand a punch from an ant. Oh man, come on, Zoidberg. You had one job, to be very tough, and you did not succeed. Okay, well, this is very much a concern. I think the Paladins are going to win this match, like the previous round, as they have had time to achieve their full potential. And that is bad. Well, not, they're not quite at full potential. They're not quite at full potential, and they're already incredible. Ugh. Aw, oh, damn. I was really hoping that one of these ants would die. Please kill these ants. Oh, please. Somebody do something. Alright, Naithu is on the field. He's got the surge armor. Don't know what to do with him though. Let's just hang on. Where is the ball currently? Where is? Oh, there it is. It's right up, right above you. Right above you. Right, so let's work together to get the ball from him. So Cutter, you're being supported from all sides. Nice. Uh oh. Oh please no. Please no. Please no. Stop it. Stop it. Why? Why do that? Okay. Well, at least he didn't injure anyone. Huh. Oh my word. Robbins? You have aggroed your opponents. Congratulations. Midas? You have not aggroed your opponents. That is a shame. Alright, so we got a triple supports. Nice. And now, Zoidberg, use your magnetic... Good. I was going to say, if you fail with your magnetic gauntlets, I am going to fire you. But you did not. So your employments will continue. Would you like to fight a robot, Thrivax? Or Naithu, I mean? Why not? Fight a robot. You failed to fight a robot, because I think that guy had SAAI equipment. Hopefully. Otherwise, you just suck. 
and Robbins uh, just guard oh Zoidberg's got repulsive gear he's gonna repulse you oh why why did I give Zoidberg repulsive gear I don't like repulsors as much now um, we'll just stick around he's gonna repulse you but then uh, maybe you want to get the ball from him maybe he's not gonna be able to hand you off the ball because you're not gonna be close enough oh well you repulse everyone who helps you out. That's great, Zoidberg. Now you're all alone. Yeah, the, the repulsor armor isn't exactly the best thing. Oh, that's XJS999. <laughs> Interesting. All nines. Maybe that one's better than the others. It almost seems like it's... But repul... Injured. Really? Zoidberg's been injured? He was my toughest guy. It was that's not supposed to happen very easily. Oh man. Okay, fine. I think the Paladins are going to win this one. Maybe it's just me. Things are not looking good. Bex. See if you can get the ball carrier to touch you in the way that gets himself shot. Haha! -ha! Alright! I am doing a good job of keeping my opponent from scoring on me at least. You've got surge pads as well there. Robbins is not. Yeesh. Okay. Go ahead and try to grab it, my friends. Nope. Nice shocking. Robbins, go for the grab. Go for the steal. Go for it. Nice, Robbins. I guess get a little bit of rushing while you can. Either that or stay next to your friend. Those ants are going to be getting back up. Ah, uh, stay next to your friend. Hopefully, the bonus can help you. Can we double team this guy? Not quite. Come on, Dead's. Oh, damn it. And he does not want to hit us. Alright then. Even though I have possession of the ball, I'm still worried about this situation. The Paladins are scary. They are scary right now. Oh no! Injury. Okay, just an injury. At least you took him down. But there goes my protection. I wish I had just ran away. Robbins has a problem. He's getting... Oh no, Robbins! No, no, no! I can't believe you dodged as much as you did there, Robbins. I'm lu you're lucky to be alive. I thought they were going to murder you. He missed. He did not pick up the ball. And the ball ran away a little bit. Thrippax, can you get it? Yes, you did. Okay, run, run, run with the ball. And Dead Soul... And Cutter will support you as best we can. Naithu has your back. This is actually actually looking like a breakaway opportunity, potentially. Although Cutter, maybe you want to stand right there because of the robots. No, I don't think the robot is providing him as much of a threat. As long as you're standing next to him to provide the guard bonus. It's the Paladins are the greater, th greater threats. Robbins, any move you make could potentially lead to your death. <laughs> Just a thought. I don't want you to... Yeah, just jump. Jump away. Jump away. I... I don't blame you for jumping away and staying alive. Please don't hit me. Thank you. 
XJS units, just try to support your friends. Alright. Alrighty. Yes! You protected yourself. Good job, guys. You guarded him from the robots. And you did not murder that robot, so you did not check your friends. Nice. Alright. That's making me feel a bit more hopeful. That's a bit concerning, but still... I am hopeful. We still have a lot of obstacles to overcome, though. No. Do not attack your opponents. That is... that is the road of destruction. Okay, slowly move forward with Thripex. So I do not want to hand off the ball. And we've got enemies on all sides of us. So we're just going to keep moving forward and hopefully we can just weather the blows that are no doubt going to be cast upon us. So Thripex is here. Naithu. Ooh, I was hoping that... Yes, okay, well... Okay, well, that was uh, equal exchange, honestly. Not what I wanted exactly, but I guess it's progress? I guess that's good? It's not entirely... At least it wasn't entirely bad. I'll say that. Hmm. If the robot is here... He can reinforce, he can give the guard value to Tripax, but no, I want you guarding on this side. You may get melee directly, but, and it may get the robot killed, but I want to take the chance to win the game. Man, I have gotten a lot of my people hurt in this match. Nice! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no! Please no! Stop it! Not the ball carrier! Oh my god! I have had bad luck with the fatal I mean, good luck with the fatalities, but bad luck with who he attacks afterwards. The, the Berserk Rage. I've had bad luck with the Berserk Rage today. At least I did some damage, but... Sheesh. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay, please no, please no. All right. Congratulations, you're standing back up again. Dead Soul. Is your time to shine, Dead Soul? Make it happen, Dead Soul. Take it out, Dead Soul. Yes! Dead Soul strikes! And that gives us an opening that we can move through. But we still have a distance to go before we get to the goal. Wow, this is a hard... If I'm gonna win... If I'm winning this... If, or I'm gonna win this, this is a hard... This is gonna be one of my hardest fought victories uh, ever. If I win this. And Robbins is having trouble just catching up without getting murdered. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Okay, thank you. And Cutter. All right, then. I really think the Paladins are going to win this, but there's a chance. There is a chance I can still win this. It's not a good one, though. The Paladins are going to have several attempts to take me down. Ooh, nice! Okay, there we go. That's what I expected. Sadly. And then they picked it up immediately. Doesn't mean it's over yet, but it's putting a kink in the works. Hot dogs indeed. Dead soul. Damn it! You got taken down by an ant. Medical belt activated. That's nice, at least. I want you supporting this ant guy here. But jumping is probably going to make you fall over, so... Just try to melee this guy. Come on, you can do it. You can do it, I believe in you! You failed. I don't believe in you anymore. At all. Please do not... 
punch Robbins in the face. What did I just say? <laughs> Alright, we've created a barrier. We have created a barrier. I can even melee this guy. Twice. Okay, he fell down. But still, barrier is here. Robbins, don't punch anyone. You're in no position to punch anyone. Cutter. Okay, I can't believe this... I can't believe this game is still going, quite frankly. Thought it'd be over long ago. It's my turn. My opponent is relatively surrounded. Nice. Dead soul. Ha ha! And now the ball is going to teleport. Over there. Damn it. I didn't think about that. If I hadn't done that, potentially Robbins could have made a breakaway. Ugh. Well, there's still a chance that Robbins might get a breakaway. Just get over there. Get over there and pick up that ball. Cutter, Robbins will support you. You want to melee one. Or if one wants to melee you. Very good. I want everyone sticking together. Now that I know how guarding works. The Paladins are just in such good shape while both of our teams have been just decimated. <laughs> the time is definitely on their side. Not to mention I've got a booster belt that any moment is going to take out Robins. Which is why you've got a booster over there, my friend. No time to lose. No time to lose. Of course, I did want to beat up this guy here. But we can still do that. Doesn't mean we can't do that. Would you like to punch a Thripex? Yes, you would! And now you're down. Alright! Injury by electrocution! That is some of the paladin's power reduced. Very good, there is hope yet. Cutter? Would a robot like to punch a cutter? That is the wrong decision. Luckily we didn't kill him because a berserk rage would not be good right now. Oh, you wanna fight? Damn it! That is the second time! Damn. Alright. That is the second time that the ants have caused the medical belt to go off on Dead Soul. That medical belt, I have definitely gotten my value out of that medical belt. That's for, that's for darn sure. Okay, if we can just keep whittling them down. We've got, we've taken out two. I want, I want to take out more. We must take out more ants. It is the only hope. All right, there's only five turns left. This might end up being another tie. That would be fine with me, I suppose. Alright, we've got you surrounded here, Mr. Ant. Would you like to strike strike a Thripax, though? Ah, you struck a Thripax. That was a bad decision. Now, uh, would you like to fight with a dead soul? Aha! I have knocked you down. Would you like to hit a cutter? Good, good, good idea. Oh, oh, wrong decision. And now you are stunned. And so, and so is he. Alright, Robbins, you're going to have to jump. Jump to it. Oh, good. You made it. Now run away! Run away. All we need to do is run out the clock. That, that running out the clock is a victory on my, in my opinion. Of course, the booster belt might cause me to get killed at any moment. But that's fine. That's fine. I just don't want the Paladins to win. They are a threat. They are a threat to my victory in the long term. 
in the greater scheme of things. No, you don't. Oh, I was a bit worried about that one. And now Robbins has a breakaway. Breakaway, Robbins. Breakaway. At the very least, you're going to get a good amount of rushing yardage, which will help your development in the future. So run for it. Oh, that's... Or good. That is a friendly robot. Who's going to say that's an enemy robot? Nope. Friendly robot. Good. 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 Protect your friendly frog. And let's see if we can gang up on a ant person, shall we? Rip axe. Dead soul. Would you like to strike a dead soul? Would you strike, like to strike a thrip axe? Would you like to have thrip axe support you when dead soul strikes you? No? Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. No violence for me this turn. Okay. Next turn. There is three turns left. Will the game, will the ball be scored in the next three turns? I doubt it. I think we have another tie. I was wondering how ties occurred so often. But now I know. It's actually a bit easier than, than one might think, than one might expect. Especially if one team is uh, determined to run out the clock. Because they're not excited about their odds of victory. <laughs> Which I am not. But I am excited about my odds of damaging the paladins. Right. Would you like to punch a dead soul? Would you like to punch a Thurbax? Ooh. Well, you failed to finish the Thurbax. Oh, not a good idea punching a Thurbax like that. Ooh. Close. Bad idea on your part. Wow, that robot is lucky. That is a lucky robot. Lucky to be alive. Would you like to punch a cutter? He'd like to punch you. Oh, why? Why did you attack me, robots? There must be something wrong with the logic circuits on that thing. Ooh, you pushed Dead Soul back. Somebody's talented in combat. They are closing in on the Robins. They're closing in from both sides. They're tightening the noose. I think I'm going to try to flee in this direction next time. Next tune. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, he'll be right there. That's fine. The XJS, XJS robot will be here to defend me. Okay, would you like to punch a Thripex? Yes, you would, and you successfully did it. Congratulations. Would Cutter be a good target for you? Nope. All right, well, would you like to be supported when Dead Soul punches you? Damn it. We used the medical belt for the third time in this match. Well, it looks like that's the end of the match. It's going to be a tie game. Right? Or is that the last turn? No, turn order. Uh, who's... I I'm last in the turn order, so one more turn. Okay. And then that'll be it. So, yeah, it's a tie game. There's... N well, I, I it's hard to imagine that anything else is going to occur in the time that is left. Besides a tie game. Let's surround a robot and beat the crap out of him. Die, robots! All right, well, that works. Let us surround an ant and beat the crap out of him. Aha, you have been shocked. But not defeated. All right, well, we had a disappointing number of successful acts of violence this game, but at least we kept the enemy from scoring. I could have tried harder to score myself, but I don't think the odds of that were very good. So I made, I think, a sound decision. Another tie game. But at least the MVP was... Dead Soul. Very good. All right. Well, I think that's enough for one session. We got two tie games in one session. 
I have 11 points. I am tied with the happy troop for first place currently. The happy troop having the same record as me with two ties, one loss, and three wins. Interesting. All right. So let's take a look at the rosters. Kermit is now ready. He is now ready for the quickening. The quickening puts his AP at 99. How does that work? 99. Will that... 9 AP. Will that... Will, will he be able to spend the 9 AP or not? Very easily. Because that's not 100. It's very close. But there's a significant difference between 99 AP and 100. Dead Soul is 139 points on the field. Or on the, on the board. Uh, he does not want to bother with healer. Unitarian. Aw. Aw. He does not want to become the healer. He wants somebody else to become the healer. Dead Soul just cares about having karma. I was hoping I could wrap around. So, Dead Soul... Dead Soul wants more powerful attack abilities. Like charge. Yeah, charge. Each checking attempt only costs 10 AP. Or juggernauts. Prevents a player from being knocked down or pushed from a check unless KO'd, injured, or killed. And resilience reduces the injury type from a successful check. Not as concerned about that as charge. I think charge is pretty freaking cool. Let's take charge. Charge! More checking for me. Jumping, no big deal. Judo, my checking is awesome. Juggling, no scoop, strip. Nope. Fist of Iron and Quickening are awesome. Doom Strike. 16% chance of injuring an opponent per uh, when you check. Okay, well, Dead Soul. Dead Soul is going to save up for Resilience, then get Juggernauts, and then become a Terror to all. Which is a 33% chance that all opposing, nearby opposing players collapse. That's pretty crazy. End Cutter is brutal now. More attack power for us. More killing power. Zoidberg's working on his way to become the healer for the team. Thripax is resilient. And is good at grabbing things. See. More, more reflexes? Not really. Don't know what exactly to do with Thripax here. I guess. The leader. Slash Hive Overseer. Hive Overseer adds an additional plus one to the Hive Mind effect. 9x only replaces leader skill. Skill. All players with, er, with all players, receive five bonus to their checking, within five tiles. Wow, an additional plus one to the hive mind effects. But, nine x only replaces it replaces the leader skill. So if I get if I get leader with the thrip axe, it's actually not going to be that useful because I only have one other bug man on my team. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of a waste. It's kind of a waste to only have one or two nine axes. I'm realizing. But oh well, that's that's what I did. I guess just go for the quickening. Go for the quickening, my friend. Quick, quick insect people do doesn't sound like the worst thing in the world. So yeah, get boxing. Increase your handling. Increase your reflexes. Increase all that good stuff. And I've been out of the game, so I don't get anything. That's fine. All righty. So. That's it for this episode of the Crush Deluxe Frungy League. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, intergalactic sports fans. Good nights.